can touch my toes! Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Cotton tail! <laughs> Bed. But it's not just an old bed, Benjamin. It's a bed made by my dad. That's his paw print. Look. Uh oh. What are we going to do, Peter? Uh, we're going to find out where this branch came from. Then we're going to fix my bed. That's it, Florence. Take a good look. Now. Fly, Florence. Go and find where this branch came from. Oh. Sorry. Guess she's tired. Uh, can you tell what kind of tree it's from, Lily? I really need it so I can repair my bed. Uh, hmm. Well, it's bendy, but it's really strong too. He must have been bouncing really hard. Yeah, I'm a pretty awesome bouncer. I'll have to check my samples. Hmm. Oak tree? Nope. Willow tree? No. Pine tree? No, not that one. Uh, no. Uh-uh. Aha! Of course! Cretaceous monogena. Excuse me? Uh, uh... Scientific name for the hawthorn bush. That's where the branches from your bed came from. It's the strongest kind of wood around here, and I know that for a fact. Great work, Lily! Let's get that wood! <laughs> Woohoo! Yeah! <laughs> yeah! Peter? Lily? Oh! Not too cold and not too hot. I like rabbits in a pot. Oh no! M Mr. Todd's out for a walk. Don't worry. Just keep quiet while we get those hawthorn branches. something in my just-in-case pocket. Just in case. Acorn, envelope, spoon, mitten, ball of string. I don't see how this is going to... Wait a second. Lily, that's it. String! It looks just like a worm. Exactly. We'll still deliver the worms, just not the way Tommy Brock expected. Let's hop to it. Pick a pine cone, any pine cone. Oh, why should I? Ah. Whoa, uh, not a magic fan? Uh, no problem. How about singing? I'm pretty good at that. La, 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 la. Oh, enough. <laughs> Your friends aren't coming back. And if I'm not going to have my worms, then at least I can have, I can have, I know. Some nice new fluffy slippers. Uh, uh, oh, of course. Why didn't you say? I'll just run to the shop and, uh, uh, I'm the slippers, aren't I? Uh, Anyone for worms? Oh, I don't believe it. Please believe it. Give him here. No <laughs> way. You let the... Benjamin go first. But... That was the deal. Oh, all right, all right. He'd hardly make one decent slipper anyway. Now, put the bucket down and get out of here. I like to eat alone. Lunch for one, coming right up. See you around, Tommy Brock. <laughs> Where are you, you fluffy little? Huh? Tommy Brock? Where did you get that bucket? Made the rabbits collect worms for me. 
And you think you're clever? <laughs> oh, you nincompoop. Those aren't worms, it's string. You've been tricked. String, eh? <laughs> nice try, but you can't fool me. Those are worms. Now give them back. Aha, rabbits. Oh, I think you can spill my lunch and get away with it? Come back here, Mr. Todd! No! Uh, uh, <gasps> so, you tricked a brainless badger out of his lunch. Well, nothing gets in the way of my lunch. You spilled my lunch! Time to get them paws dirty, Mr. Todd! And dig me up some worms to eat! Oh, confounded worms! This is impossible! <laughs> Oi! Less chat and more worm catching, thank you! Oh. <laughs> hey, Mr. Todd! Try acting like a bird, it really helps! <laughs> 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 What's going on? I'm on an important mission. What mission? Nuts! We're harvesting hazelnuts for the winter. Nibble, nibble, nibble all winter long. Woohoo! <laughs> <laughs> Looks like fun. Can we help? Help? Hmm? No, you can't. It's not really a rabbity kind of thing. Ha! That's what you think. Crazy Peter, I can relate to that. But you better leave it to the experts, like me. <laughs> Don't worry about it, Peter. Hmm. Maybe I should try climbing up to the nuts instead. Rabbits can't climb trees. I know that for a fact. Then we'll just find another way. A good rabbit never gives up. What if I stand on your shoulders, Benjamin? It might make them sore, but it'll be worth it. Um. I'd love to, Peter, but it's about time I went home. Uh, Dad wants me to help him with a new invention. Hmm, that's it. What's it, Peter? We need someone to invent a way for rabbits to collect hazelnuts. And who is the best inventor we know? My dad! <laughs> oh, a nut-gathering invention, you say? <laughs> It needs to reach up high. Oh, oh, and pick the hazelnuts of trees and gather them all up. Fascinating, but I'm extremely busy at the moment working on my latest invention. May I present the automated tidy apparatus? Hmm. Observe. There. It's perfect! We could use this to gather the nuts! What a marvellous idea, Peter! Quite the young inventor, aren't you? Well, he spends a lot of time with me. <laughs> uh, let me just empty the basket. Oh. Uh, <coughs> 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 uh, one thing. Uh, make sure it doesn't overheat. We'll be careful. Thanks, Uncle. Ha! Automated nut gatherer. Well, well. <laughs> hey! What's the big idea? Looks like rabbits can collect nuts after all. Fire it up, Benjamin! <laughs> Six, 
Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. Ready or not, here I come. I know you're around here somewhere. Ha ha! Found you, Benjamin! Hmm, nice move, cousin. Benjamin, this is my hiding place. <gasps> Shh! Peter's coming. Nice try, Lily. Found you! <laughs> oh, not fair. If I could tunnel like Benjamin, you'd never find me. Uh, tunneling's no big deal. Can you show me how to do it? Of course we will. We'll teach you to tunnel, won't we, Peter? Um, yeah, but first I... I, oh, I just remembered. I promised my mum I'd be home for lunch. See you later. That's strange. Why did he run off like that? And he didn't even ask us over for lunch. Oh, well. If you need me, I'll be at the blackberry bush. <laughs> Excuse me. Dig, dig, dig. <laughs> that's not a tunnel, that's a dent. There must be something about it in here. How do I dig a tunnel? <sighs> Nothing. Never be a good tunneler. Never say never, Peter. <gasps> Mum! You know, your father wasn't much of a tunneler either when I first met him. But he still dug out this whole burrow for us. He did? Yes. Actually, he dug eight burrows. The first seven fell down. <laughs> but this one? This one is home. So, how did he ever learn how to dig? Well, he kept trying until he found a way that worked for him. Just like you'll find a way that works for you. Oh yeah, these paws can find a way. I'll be the best digger in the hole. Peter! Oh, uh, I wasn't doing anything. Peter, I think something's happened to Benjamin. Come on. <laughs> Jack Sharp! Stand your ground! You've got no time to get away! Stand your ground! Come on, think fast and you can save the day! You can't just run this game, it's all or none! You've got to use your wits to get you through! So stand your ground! What are you gonna do now? You're gonna take me Whoa. back to your friends and cook me up for dinner? Whoa, uh, probably not. Uh, not cook you, not eat you at all, really. I prefer carrots or radishes, that sort of thing. Wait a minute. Th that blue jacket. Are you. Could it be? Uh, I'm Peter Rabbit. Peter Rabbit? I don't Whoa. believe it. Uh. Uh. You look just like your father. Right, and I'm here to finish what my dad started. I'm going to reel you in and get you out of this lake. You've been scaring people long enough. Scaring people? Oh, I'm tired and old. I just want to be left alone. What's so bad about that? Mr Fisher said you were horrible and nasty. You'd be horrible and nasty if someone was always trying to catch you. Peter! Your father understood. That's why he let me go. I understand too. Does that mean you'll let me go? Yeah. Uh, 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 hey. whoa, I'm gonna fall in. Oh. Hey. Hold on, I've got an idea. What's going on? The fish is eating him. I just know it. No, I can still see him. He's still alive. 
but he's wrestling Jack Sharp to the end. Oh, uh, that tickles. Uh, <laughs> oh. Still. Uh, uh, that's not good. Oh, I seem to be just a little bit stuck out here. Let me help. Huh? I mean, that's what friends do, isn't it? Help each other. Oh, thanks, Jack. Woohoo! <laughs> Thank goodness you're all right. Wow! I've never seen a boat go that fast. Did you catch him? Let's see. Oh, where is he? <laughs> Peter, what happened? <laughs> OK, ready? Say it now. Oh, do we have to? Go on. It's amazing, I promise. Looks like rain, Benjamin. Looks like rain, Benjamin. Rain, you say? Then it's time for my dad's latest amazing adventure. Whoa! <gasps> oh, Frederick B. Boats' sensational craft Benjamin! What do you think? Uh, <laughs> it's very big, yet surprisingly small. <laughs> That's the beauty of it. Folded up, it's tiny. Then, when it rains, all you have to do is click the button like this and... Rabbit, you almost sent me flying! Sorry, Mrs. Puddle Duck. My poor, poor nerves. Oh, a shock like that could. <laughs> Whack! Oh, my! Benjamin! Ah! Oh! Are you all right? Oh. oh, no, I'm not. You've made me late, and I must, must, must get to Ginger and Pickle's shop before it closes, or there'll be no oatmeal for breakfast. Mrs. Puddle Duck, you forgot your egg. Oh! Oh, me. So I did. But, oh, I'll never make it in time carrying this the whole way. Don't worry. We'll watch your egg for you. It's the least we can do. Gosh! How kind. Well, thank you, Peter Rabbit. Do be careful now. Choppity chop, off to the shop. Wow, that was so nice of you, Peter. Here, let me help. I'm great at egg sitting. Don't worry, it's in safe hands. <gasps> <Whoa! laughs> ah, I suppose I should do it. After all, exiting is a very important job. I'm the best one to handle it. For your information, Lily, I'm very good at important jobs. You? Yes, me. OK, but you'll need to be alert and patient and very careful. All right, Lily, I don't need a list. <sighs> oh! <laughs> ah, Benjamin, Peter, Lily. Ah, perfect timing. Can't stop, Dad. We're on an important mission. We're rescuing Cottontail's blanket. But there's a storm brewing. That's why we're racing. We need to get the blanket before the storm breaks. Oh! <sighs> <sighs> What an amazing invention, <laughs> Mr. Bouncer. Why, thank you. It's my new pedal powered house sweeper. <laughs> is that a box pan chip ringer junction you're using? Or is it a simple frequency expander? <laughs> Lily Bobtail, you certainly know a lot about how machines work. Peter, it'd be a shame if it got <sighs> ruined in the rain. <sighs> hmm, you're right. There's still time to help. The storm is a long way off. I hope you're right. <laughs> OK, time to go. Hold on. You might need this. My turbocharged pocket pop umbrella. Oh, thanks, Dad. Oh, no! No, no. <laughs> Thank you all. 
<laughs> How do you close this thing? Here, let me try. There you go. <gasps> oh. Let's get Cottontail's blankets. Ah, get inside the coop, you naughty dog cleanser! Oh, yahoo, rabbits! Oh, thank goodness! There's a storm coming and I can't get my naughty ah, dog cleanser into the coop! Oh. Sorry, Mrs Puddle Duck, but we have to get Cottontail's blanket. Oh, gracious me! Come back, you cheeky things! Gotcha! <gasps> Uh-oh, the storm! We still got time to help. Come on, guys. Come back. Ooh. Over there. This way. Wait. Uh, hey. There you are. Ah! Safe and sound. I think that's all of them. Oh, thank you. Ah! Huh? Oops. Nearly all of them. <laughs> thank you. <laughs> thank you. Oh. I'd lose my head if it wasn't fixed to my body. Peter! The storm is getting really close. Ah! Uh, let's go home. You know what my dad used to say. A good rabbit never gives up. We have to get Cottontail's blanket. Let's go. Thank you. Where did you go, you slippery little... Cheeky rabbit, give that back! Try this on for size. I'll put you in a pain! It's now or never! <gasps> agreed never to tell them about that crash. Yes. Oh, I, I suppose Mr. Bouncer may have let slip the tail of the flying machine. <gasps> Me? I believe you showed them the photograph, Mr. Fisher. All right, there's no sense in arguing about it now. Anyway, I'm sure Peter and his friends aren't up to anything they shouldn't be. But Peter is always up to something, isn't he, Mopsy? Always, Flopsy. Oh, oh dear. I don't believe it! You found it! Of course we did! Nice of you to drop in, Peter. Uh, sorry if we made you jump. It's easier to fly than it is to land. Do you know what this means? Now we can all go on flying trips wherever we want! Think of the exploration! Oh, I'd love to visit the far side of the lake again. Excellent fishing over there, you know. Now, now, let's not get too excited, gentlemen. I'm happy that they found the flying machine, but the sky is no place for a rabbit. Isn't that right, Peter? Peter? Peter Rabbit. Just like your father. Peter! to get me over my fear of heights. Oh. <laughs> Too tight? No, that's just fine. I wonder what's over that hill. Only one way to find out. What do you say then? One more time? Life is, is one, one big adventure! 